you are too young to start saying you hate men. I, I've had a bad experience with men. What's your bad experience? Um, mm, um, in 2022, I met a boy at Res and he was always cheating on me. That's your experience? Yes. Yes. He said he loved me. Come. There's a tablet. There's a tablet they were recommended for you. Are you hearing me? Tablet? Yes. Your BP. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I'm talking to this one here. Who is she to you? Oh, this is my aunt. Your mother's sister. Her, she's my daughter. Yes, her mother. Her mother is at home back in uh, KZN, Coxat. Coxat? Yes, sir. Because... There is bipolar in our family. Yes, yes, there is. My uncle has bipolar. And it's disturbing our mother's mental health also. Yes, my mom's very stressed. Mother is very stressed and worried about her. In fact, all of us in the family, we are worried about her. Because that's what I'm, I'm trying to say now is your turn. You are worried about her. Meanwhile, it's your turn. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. I hear you. It is your turn. That's, I'm seeing a, 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 a recommendation for you to be an anti present that be a depressed for depression for me sir yes, yes. i've been through a lot sir yeah. it's it's by god's grace that i haven't picked up papers on the street huh? it's by god's grace that i have not lost my mind and start picking up people on the street that I'm it's telling god's you. grace it's not to look beautiful like this who see you say oh beautiful woman look at your green and green oh, it's no. a lot it's a lot sir. that is it you see with the, in the eyes of eternity she's she's mad picking paper. Why are you looking like that? I'm just amazed. After her is you. You. Sorry. <laughs> is it you? So the family need deliverance. True, sir. Very much. The whole family. Why I want us to pray for our mother. I saw the mother jumping inside like water. And people would, would drown herself. Jesus. Huh? My mother, you wouldn't think of that for her because she doesn't say things like that she's the type of person who will tell you i'm scared of death so she, i wouldn't she's hiding herself from people now she's hiding a lot of things she don't want to talk she doesn't sir in fact it, it's not only her that doesn't want to talk most of us in the family it's like that evil will not happen in your family amen 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 today's the first time Sorry, sir. Is today our first time? Yes, it's our first time, sir. The course will be broken. Amen. 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 You are too young to start saying you hate men. Oh, yes, I am. Yeah? I, I've had a bad experience with men. How old are you? 23. What is your bad experience? Um, mm, um, in 2022, I met a boy at Res and he was just just a cheater huh? he was always cheating on me that's your experience yes yes he said he loved me is, is there what he said he loved me so why would you cheat on someone you love you say what he said he loved me then he mistreated me i didn't mistreat you he had a female best friend uh-huh yeah and then he'd bring other girls into his room and i could hear him you could hear them hmm. doing what? Talk it. Uh, I could hear them having sex. Huh? I could hear them having sex. And you were there? Yes, I was. That's your experience? Yes. What an experience. It's too early. It's too early. It's too early. Okay, it's too early because... Yes, sir. Because it's a demon that is manipulating your mind now. You will, you will be a big lady in this nation and you will become satanic evangelists. If they don't pray for you, you will be recruiting young people. God forbid. God, eh? God forbid. God forbid. God forbid. <laughs> because a sexual choice will be affected. I reject it, sir. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, before you even get there. Never, <laughs> not, not in my family. None in of my children in, in Jesus', Jesus name. name. Amen. Uh, we are still going there. Amen. You see that memory she has? Yes, sir. Is playing. In her mind. I hear you, sir. So even in her dream, the devil is now bringing naked people. Yes. Huh? Yes. 
You always see naked people. Yes. What are they doing? Nothing. Just seeing them shocked. Eh? The, sometimes they are masturbating themselves. And these women, you always see women. Yes. Is that what I'm saying? She would be a a, a demonic evangelist recruiting young young girls to the kingdom of darkness. God forbid. God forbid. That's why she's seeing naked people. There. Always, always, and this mystery is bigger than you people. There's only this sight I'm talking about that can see it. I know it. You know it. Mm? How you know? The mystery, the mystery you're talking about. Uh, how do you know? Talk to talk to me, my <laughs> sir. There is a strong man in my family. Yeah. There's, there's a witchcraft background. Really? Yes. Huh? Yes. Is it what you are saying is opposite of what you're saying? She will be free today. Amen. Amen. You know, according to her, this have experience. Like said, you are too young. For this does damage her amen yes sir God. she will be free today amen, amen. you know according to her this is her experience like said, you are too young amen. for this hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Salo. please do not forget to subscribe comment like and of course to share this video Mithalin Tamas's mother Pumla and her cousin are trending all over social media after this video of them at a church has gone viral. Now Pumla had visited a Nigerian pastor's church. The pastor's name is David Uche so he picked Mithalin's mom and cousin because he had a prophecy for them you guys. Pastor Uche started telling started by asking rather the cousin if there is any case of mental health in the family well the cousin said her uncle had does indeed have that history mitlali's mother upumla revealed that she too had a mental illness she suffered from depression she actually told the pastor you guys that it is by god's grace that she hasn't she hasn't picked up papers in the streets and the pain in her voice was truly heartbreaking, you guys, when she said that. And now, you guys, Pastor Uche then further went on to say to Pumla that he sees her in the prophecy being diagnosed with bipolar and he needs to pray for her to break the illness that will be given to her. However, people in the comments section of that video, which has been removed on the pastor's page, they're saying that the pastor could have done a little bit of research about Pumla because she is in the public space, you guys, and he knew her family's background, probably including the mental illness history in the family. They also said that with these Nigerian pastors, they like playing mind games with South Africans because we love miracles and Pumla, of course, is in the public space and it's really not that difficult to trace her people from her town and do a little bit of research. And guys, these pastors are um, chance takers, basically. Pastor Uche told Mitali's cousin that if she does not get delivered, she might also suffer from the same illness. He said the family needs deliverance, the whole family. Mitali's mom said the family struggles to talk about their issues and this is the first time they are consulting a prophet. And you guys, and that's when he prayed for both Mitali's mom and the cousin and that's when they fell and eventually God delivered you guys. Anyways, what are your thoughts? Please do share them with me in the comment section and of course do not forget to subscribe if you haven't yet done so i will definitely see you on the next video thank you so much for actually clicking and deciding to watch this video bye